So they've got an opportunity to get the first strike on the board. Start with an offensive zone face-off and a chance to get out in front. Oh, what a stop! Moves it quickly over to Weber. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. And look at this, a three-on-one. Made that stop. Whoa. Scores! Power play goal! Uh, critical for them to get on the board with the extra man. They move the puck well, and they're able to capitalize. The Canadians deliver early with an opening goal here at home. Now, I love the way that they were able to get themselves into the game quickly, play at the pace they want to, and capitalize on that chance. Montreal and now goal. it's grabbed by Hedman. Smart defensive play there. Montreal's ready to go on the attack. Oh, puts it wide! Funny shot, though. He takes a big formal through and doesn't get much on it. Just trickles by the post. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Points been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. Kakaniemi's been nabbed for tripping. Reaching out for the puck. I guess it's a little bit of a bad play. You've got to realize the guy's getting away. Let him go before you take the penalty. The officials making him pay for it. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. Scooped up along the wall by Sherratt. And they can't convert the play. And that shot gets caught in traffic. And they fail to go take to take. They've got numbers. It's a two on one. Turned aside with the glove by Vasilevsky. Goes full circle with the puck. Here's the pass. There it is. It's in. I don't, I don't think it's going to matter, James. I get a look at this immediately. I think no goal. This was waved off hard immediately. Gord's good work is not going to be rewarded. This is pretty clearly goalie interference. I don't see how it can be anything but. Well, we'll get a second look on this one here, but the official's pretty firm on it. Play set to resume, and you can see they're still frustrated by that non-goal call. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. With possession along the wall. From the blue line, denied by Vasilevsky. Moves it to Maroon. Inside the offensive zone. And the power play comes up empty. Both teams back to even strength. You work so hard to get yourself back in the game. You earn a power play, and then you fail to cash in. So they still trail by one. The game will continue at even strength. Jostling for the puck, and it's knocked away. Snaps one on net. Scores! Well, I think we might be in for it. Anything you can do, I can do better sort of night. Yeah, this is starting to look like a game that can stretch out and end up in overtime. These teams are evenly matched. Plenty of playing time left in this frame. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Assisted by number 37, Montreal's on the attack. Seven minutes, six seconds. The Lightning have it in their own zone. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. The centerman glide into position. Tampa Bay's won it. Sends the pass over. There's a shot just wide of the net. Grabbed along the board by McDonough. Way too much congestion blocks that. Tees him up. Scores! Gets the friendly back. Happened so quickly, you beat the goalie, you know it's in, except lots of times it won't. This one bounces his way. There are different sounds when the puck hits the goal post. It's a thud if it is directly on. This one's a ping, and you know it's on the inside of the pipe and into the net. Taken by Hedman, and that pass goes awry. Takes the pass. Eric Churdan. Centered out in front, can't connect, can't connect. Sends it over to Palat. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. Quick feed to point, 
And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Puck grab by Kucherov. Punks it away to keep the pressure on. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Quick pass to Kotkaniemi. Big save. Puts him into the wall. James, there's the difference between getting by or getting crunched. He's a half a second from a great move. Instead, he got flattened. Here's a shot, and he makes the save. He scores! Jumps on the rebound and buries it! Followed through to the net, he picks up this rebound, makes no mistake. Once the goalie leaves the puck in front of the net, the goalie's at your mercy, and he does not miss. The Lightning have taken a two-goal lead here early in this first period. Changes the whole complexion of the game. Down one to down two. Now you start to feel like you have to take a chance every once in a while. Taken along the wall by Petrie. Oh, he got all of that with the blocker by Vasilevsky. Yeah, it's in a dangerous spot. He makes a good save here. He got thunderstruck from the back of the cage with the puck. The Bolts have it against the wall. Steps across the blue line. Picked up along the wall by Sorelli. And he denied that opportunity. And there's a whistle on the play here, stopping it. I, I try yeah, to figure out where the puck is. Of the puck here, James. He's, you can see him working for position. Eventually, he doesn't have it, so he blows it dead. Getting into the later stages of this period, the Bolts now lead by two. Tampa Bay's gained possession. The Canadians take possession in the defensive end. Here's a short pass to Kulak. And they send it right back to him. Takes the feed. Tremendous stop by Vasilevsky. The Canadians have it in the offensive end. Wow. They score! Le Glovier deliver! Montreal still trailing here in this opening period despite excellent scoring opportunities in the offensive zone. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. The Canadians gain possession in their own end. The Bolts have it from the corner, and they can't connect. Quick cross ice pass to Kulak. The Canadians are in transition. What a steal in his own end. Gord's moving the puck through his own zone. Moves it over to Maroon. Puts it up front. Oh! There's going to be a regret in this one. That might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just miss the pass. The scoring chance goes away. Well, if you came to see offense, you certainly did in that first period as it finally comes to an end. It can enter the seating area and cause serious injury. Well, the first 20 is in the books. Let's see what this second period offers. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Vasilevsky's had lots of pad taps in that first period, James. I don't know what the score might look like if he wasn't so good. And makes the save. Moves it quickly over to Deneau. Here they are on the attack. Sends it across, poked away. The Lightning have taken possession along the wall. Takes it at center. Moves it to Kucherov. Centering pass in front, and they can't convert to the play. Runs them hard against the boards. Couldn't connect on that pass. Quick feed to Gallagher. That pass doesn't go. Gains the zone on the left wing. Slides it across. Montreal's got the puck along the boards. Weber's taken down to the ice. We got a penalty coming up. And here comes the judgment from the official. The Bolts will lose a man tripping the call. Funny, coaches always tell you, get your stick on the puck. And then when you try and the guy trips up, they tell you, get your stick out of there. Kind of stop. The Canadians send their man advantage unit out once more. Well, they've gotten themselves to within one. Now they've got a power play opportunity to try and even the score. The best power plays always work when the feet and the puck are moving at the same time. Comes up with the stop as he got a piece of the blocker on it. Denies him. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops. 
before the puck is cleared away. The Canadians have had a lot of things go their way tonight, except for the score in which they trail here in the second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, that's got to hurt. What a play. Picked up along the boards by Perry. Handles the puck. Here's a howitzer at the net, and he blocks the shot. Great defensive play. Drills him. Quick pass to Coleman. Chernak's got it across the line. The Bolts will play it from the defensive zone. And now he moves it to Coleman. Centering pass, and that's picked off in front. The Bolts get back to even strength as the penalty killing unit delivers. Well, they'll stay in the lead here with some excellent work by their penalty killer. From the goaltender on up, they did a nice job there. Moves it quickly over to Coleman. And that's broken up with a stick in front. The Canadians take it across the line. The Bolts have a hold of it in the defensive zone. From the boards, he takes that pass. Zero fear on this guy's part as he blocks it. Here he is from the slot. He scores! We are tied! I like the way they've gone about this, James. They've kept working away, not taking too many chances and their work has resulted in a tie game. The good thing he one-times his puck, the goalie almost gets there, but the pass is on his tape in the low slot, and he beats him clean. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. Puck scooped up by Sergachev. That's just textbook positioning to break up the play. Here's a short pass to Anderson. Scooped up along the wall by Johnson. Nice speed from the left side up the middle. Right in front, can't connect. Puck picked up by Sergachev. Trying to shake loose. He's in. What a save on the play. Well past the midway mark of this period, we got a tie game. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Pokes it away in his own end. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Moves it to Maroon. On the attack along the boards. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. One on one with the goaltender. Here we go. Scores! The go ahead goal! Uh, this game has been tight. Now somebody's got a leg up. The Canadians take a one goal lead here in the second. This game doesn't look like it's going to stretch out at all now, James. Even though there is a lead, it seems like it'll stay close. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. By number 14. Assisted by number 73. Sends it down low. Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. Looks like we got a delayed tripping penalty coming up here. Official blows the whistle. Let's see what the call is. Well, the official's going to give him two minutes to think about that one. Yeah, you can argue for a few seconds, James, I guess, but you already know at this point you're going to sit down. Another power play opportunity coming up here. Sometimes it's just your night, and the way that they've performed on the power play, it kind of feels like they're going to get another one. Tampa, Bay penalty to Tampa Bay's seven. won the draw. Hedman's picking up steam. Here's a chance on the doorstep, and that one's broken up. Stopped by the goaltender. Scores! And the power play strikes again. James, they've been working on this in practice for the last little while. It's come through big for them tonight. The Canadians have made their way back to center ice with now a little breathing room, a two-goal lead late in the second. After the initial rush on the bench, the coach was down and back on the bench, reminding everybody, don't take any time off. Let's get to the intermission where we are. Quick feed to Kulak. Pass right back. Moves the puck to Anderson. Can't catch up to the pass. Now over to Sorelli. Nice dish from the left wing. Quick pass to Sorelli. And now it's grabbed by Stamkos. Answered the call there. Oh, he reads the play really well to get out and aggressive to make that save. 
Moves it quickly over to Kotkaniemi. Here's a chance. Nice save by the keeper to trap. 